What's up fam? It's Massage Den. This week's video is so short because it's a look back on the very first sketchbook I ever got. Enjoy! Okay, so this is the very first sketchbook I ever owned and it was gifted to me and as you can see on the sticker it says Musashi was here. I used to draw that in the little face all over my middle school. <laughs> yeah. And uh, as you can see, it's actually not backwards. I'm actually left-handed and the seam would get in my way. So I took the sticker off the front and just taped it on the back because I really like that sticker for whatever reason I even covered it in. But I was drawing in the front at first and then I switched it around so I could draw better. And so let's get started here. First, this is the oldest drawing of a human that I have. It is clearly from 1999 <laughs> and it states that uh, she was Trunks's mate. Obviously, she's like from Dragon Ball Z, the daughter of Turles, get out of here. All right, so this is the first sketchbook. I drew this on the front of every sketchbook that I had. I had a pet Vegeta, like don't ask, but the date there says 5-4-2-K. That's May 4th of 2000. And the first picture is of <laughs> Piccolo and LP, an original character that I made that looked just like him. And it's awful. Why is he wearing a hat? Because I hated his antenna, that's why. <laughs> and then there's another OC shocker. She looks just like Hiro Yui. Like, I'm so shocked. Like, that was my thing back then. When I was creating an original character, I would make it look like, just make the girl look like the love interest. And I have no idea who this guy is, but I assume that he's their son. I have no idea why he has wings. Oh, it's Drake. Okay, funny story. Drake is actually who Oliver turned into eventually. That's how Oliver started life as a girl. And Isis, I still draw her every now and then. She is another OC from The Legend of Zelda. But I don't know enough about like the series and stuff. And it has a time on it because I guess I drew that one at 1 o'clock and this one at 3.15. I had like a ton of time to draw back then. Oh, this is Kaiten. This is my Outlaw Star OC that went nowhere. That's why you don't see her nowadays. So yeah, it looks like I drew all of these like in the same day. I have no idea who these people are. Um... I just have no idea. And then it says I drew, like, why was I up at 4 a.m.? Like, on a school night? Was that a school night? Sephiroth and Courtney. Okay. <laughs> Funny story about these so, two. For a bit of story time about um, Courtney and Sephiroth. Shocker, I used to love Sephiroth in Final Fantasy VII. Like, I was all in love with his character. Every time we had to stop him from doing something, I was like, why? No, let him go. Because, you know, he's great. But then, um... <laughs> my best friend can attest to this in the final fight in final fantasy 7 if you do not have a specific um I almost called it mana it's called materia if you don't have a specific materia you cannot beat sifferoth's final form and he will just continually turn you into a frog until you know he eventually just kills you with that one freaky wing of his and that's when that character insert died is because I started hating Sifroth because he like stopped turning me into a frog you jerk like Sifroth's a jerk like I started out loving him but now I hate him spoiler alert she's a self-insert Mary Sue yeah guilty sorry I'm so sorry about that that's awful that's just awful poor duo I have no idea what's going on in this picture Jeez. oh this is uh, Rowan from Ronan Warriors and his girlfriend who looks just like him. That was my thing. So sorry. This is my female version of Goku in a bathing suit. I have no words. This is my female version of Piccolo in a bathing suit. I was doing a calendar apparently and that's all I have for that side. Uh, for the front. Oh no, wait. Uh... For the front, yeah, that's where it starts. And it's just this picture of Goku and Vegeta looking very confused. Um, as you can see, the date says 1-1-2000. This sketch is 18 years old right now. And it's actually not an original work. It's something that I referenced heavily from somebody else's fan art of Dragon Ball Z from back then. So, 
Yeah, oh, look at your boy, it's Ryo Wildfire. Oh my God, I used to be so in love with this freaking character. Love him so much. What y'all know about Ronin Warriors? Y'all don't know nothing about the very first Magical Boy series. And then there's this photo of Vegeta and Bulma, which again is another reference. And I used to ship them so hard. I used to love them so much when I found out they ended up together. Oh, and then the sad picture of Trunks crying. That's so sad because it looks weird. And why is only half of it inked? That's weird. And then there's this mess. I, another reference from fan art from back then like these fan art pieces cannot be found anymore up oh, and if you're a true Dragon Ball Z fan you'll realize you'll know what poster that's from um and then that's it for this sketchbook I was tearing out pages you're not supposed to do that like don't do that don't tear pages out of your sketchbook just keep going but yes that is my very first sketchbook that's it for this week's video like I said these sketches are 18 years old if you want to see how I currently draw please visit my DeviantArt or Instagram I'm Massage Dan here there and everywhere thanks for watching